Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah. Ah. Uh oh, you going in the hole. Whoa, what do you see, bro? Right here, snake What? Snake You want a milkshake? What? No, snake shake. Oh, snake shake. Oh. Could be eating baby at once. Dude, snake shed. I thought you were saying something about a milkshake. Oh. That's pretty fresh. It wasn't here in a couple days ago. Yeah, and it's still kind of soft. Oh, yeah, that's soft. Feel it, bro. Yep, that's. It's not like all hard and crunchy. Yeah. Whoa. There's a guana right here, too. Really? Guys, check this out. There's wildlife everywhere. Look at this. Snake shed. And it's still moist. Drop some comments if you know what type of snake this is. This is just weird. Look at that. These animals are smart, guys. They're super smart. And they're growing. That's why they're shedding. I think we're on to something, bud. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Iguana in the hole. Iguana in the hole. Oh. I just saw her tail sticking out when I ripped her out. She was trying to dig? Look, Whoa. even shit in here. Whoa. Dude. Good job, man. Wow, look at that, guys. She's all sandy from digging. Look at that. Our friend Dylan just got an iguana out of this hole. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, she's trying to dig and lay those, those oh. eggs. She's got... Yeah. Look. She's fat. Guys, look what happened. There was a hole here. And this iguana was trying to dig a nest. Our friend Dylan, though, just grabbed her right before she could escape mm -hmm. and was able to pull her out the nest. You bad, bad iguana. You're coming with us, buddy. What do you see, bud? Oh, right by these little baby little trees or something. Yeah, they're, they're digging holes. They're getting ready for that time. They're trying to figure out a good spot to lay them eggs. They just done this, too. Look. Look at all of this. Wow. Wow. These are going they're not messing around. Right there. What do you see, bro? Oh man, looks like he's right there. Really? Trying to get him out of the tree. Yeah, let's see if I can grab him real quick. Right here? Right here? Right there, see it? Yeah. Oh. You got him, bro? My eyes stings. Hold on. Wait. Hold him down. He's got a feisty tail, bro. Okay. Uh, Good? Is my eye okay, dude? Yeah. Is it red? Yeah. Ah. Get the man some milk. I need some oh, milk. Look at Alpha in the tree over there. This iguana, he was in the tree. Our buddy Dylan spotted him. Real quick. Dylan, go next to the tree with the iguana and show everybody at home the camouflage of this animal. Look at that. Down to a T. The same exact color as the bark. Show him the underbelly, Dylan. Like a tiger. Look at that. Whoa. The orange underbelly. Look at this. Look like at this. A tiger. That's insane, guys. These animals, they can go from green to brown orange. to orange. Blue, red, they could get to some blue. They can go white. They can turn a bunch of colors. As you've seen, this one is super feisty. We grabbed it, it was spinning like a ballerina. I grabbed it and then what happened, Dylan? Tail whipped me right in the face. Right in the eye. But check this out. We thought this was a male. But it's an alpha female. But it's a female. It's a female. That explains why she's super feisty. She probably has eggs, probably has hormones, and probably is not in the best mood that's why she flipped out and tailed to me. You want to see something cool though? Check this out. She literally has one green scale. You see oh. that? I don't know if the viewers at home can see that. Look at that. Literally one single green scale. 
That is pretty incredible. But that just shows why she was feisty, guys. Yep. This is actually the first red female we caught all day, huh? Yeah. We've been catching the females, but they've been they've been green. Mm -hmm. This one is red and this one is soup. Look at her. Super super feisty guys he has a scar she has a scar right here this is a girl this is crazy oh this is crazy usually the boys are, are orange yep. this is a female that has turned orange dylan why is this female orange because uh she might have bred with a giant alpha like the one in the tree way over there so she might be like she might have the dominant in her to be like alpha she thinks she's real alpha, she thinks she's real alpha right she thinks she's real alpha, guys. That's why she's turned orange. Usually females always turn green, stay green. They never turn orange. This female, in her mind, she really believes she's an alpha. She thinks she's the queen of all iguanas and no other iguana is entitled to, to, to take her space or breed with her other than an alpha. Mm -hmm. Look at that, an orange alpha female, Look at this. dude. Like alpha. That's incredible. have this orange right here. Look at this, a female. It's a orange. female. It's a female and she's full of eggs. Mm -hmm. That's why she's orange. She's dominant. So you know what that means, right? She probably bred with the male. Like she's that. She's orange. That. And now the babies, if they hatch, they might also be dominant. They might also be dominant. As crazy as that sounds, it makes sense. Drop some comments and let us know what you guys think about this phenomenon of uh, orange alpha females. Why do the females turn orange? And also, do these alpha females make more eggs or make dominant offspring? Drop some comments. Wait, let's let us try and know. get a double up real quick. Okay. We're going to go ahead and put this one in the bag. We're going to see if we can get a double up. Got the alpha female. Let's go. Guys, I don't, I don't think you guys understand how crazy this phenomenon actually is. Like I said, females are known to be green. Some of them could be alpha. They get big and fat. But guys... This is probably the most dominant female I've seen this year. That says a lot. She's big, she's fat, Alpha. she's orange, and she's mean. And she's pregnant. Look at that. Uh -huh. She's full of eggs. Probably up to 60. Oh, there goes the boy. She's full of eggs, guys. This is a phenomenon that's happening. The females are starting to turn orange. We don't know what is going on, but we just wanted to bring you guys this update and show you guys. Huge shout out to our friend Dylan for the spot on this female because mm -hmm. i cannot see her y'all but check her out she's turning bright and orange just like a tiger you know it's kind of weird look at her knee but look at that knee skinny fat kinda yeah weird. whoa maybe she's been fighting all right another one in the bag oh i see two giant males i see three i know two so guys sometimes we come out here we see birds like this with the red face but this one has a white face look there's two there's two of them whoa what are those look white faces guys drop some comments and let us know what they are look they're trying to eat something but we see them with the red face right Dylan? Yep. Oh, i've never seen That's a white right face one there. So this is a native bird eating an invasive snail. Whoa. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Our, our boy Dylan said he sees like three iguanas next to this golf course. Or this, I'm sorry, this tennis court. Why are the iguanas hanging out where people play tennis? It doesn't make sense. Oh, I see another one up there. Oh yeah, whoa. He's at the basketball court. Really? What is going on? All right, let's go see if we can say what's up to one of these iguanas, bro. These bad iguanas. Yeah, why are they hanging out this tennis court? It doesn't make sense, guys. There's a lot of... Oh, they're starting to run. Oh, yeah, there's four of them. Whoa, what were they doing? Oh, wow. Look 
looking for iguanas. Do you see any? Uh, uh, no, I haven't. Okay, thanks. Oh my gosh. Oh, dude, I think you got a baby alpha. Look at him. Look at him. Flip him here. Flip him here. Just bring him right here. Let's not scare the other. Yeah, flip him right in the air. Come here, buddy. Oh. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. 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 Dude, he's feisty. Hold him right there. Oh, gotcha, buddy. Gotcha. We got a couple questions for you, guy. Whoa. Dude, careful with this one, bro. We know the iguana's hair can be really feisty. This one looks like he's extra feisty. Look at his dewlap. You got him around the waist. Nice. Careful, bro. Here, you want to take the snare off of him? Sure. Back here. Yeah. Whoa. Wow. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Just calm down, buddy. More pores. Just calm wow. down. We just got a couple questions for you. Dylan, what type of iguana is this, man? It's a leopard. It is a um, leopard. See? Little leopard spots. Dude, look at the blue on him. He's got a little blue right there. And right here, look at the spikes. Yeah, he's got blue on his spikes. But you know what's crazy? When you when you caught him, his dewlap came out. His dewlap was red mm -hmm. or orange. Let me see his dewlap again. Wow. Look at the dewlap. Wow, guys. Hey, great catch, man. Right around the waist. Uh -oh. right around Wait, the waist. you want to try and catch that one? Yeah, we got it. You want to catch that one? Sure. All right, cool. Come here, buddy. Guys. This is insane. Look at this. Guys, it's insane the colors of these iguanas that are out here. Look at look at just look at all the different colors on his head. It's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. You see okay, get him. It's a baby alpha. Oh, oh. He's gone. Guys, it's absolutely insane the colors of these lizards that are taking over Florida. Now you might think iguanas are just green, but that's not true. Look at look at his head right there. Look at all the different shades of blue, green, orange. There's some purple, there's some indigo, and, and even the dewlap is orange and red. So many different colors of all these iguanas. And we just caught this one. He looks feisty. Drop some comments on what we should name this iguana. Yeah. Where? Yeah. Remember he's right on the It's incredible, guys. Just put it like that. Literally incredible. We have dinosaurs out here. These iguanas are supposed to be on an island. Not here in the state of Florida. But yes, they are here. So me and my friend Dylan, we got to catch them all.